From work to jail, right now a local woman is locked up, accused of threatening to shoot up a school. Corey Davis is joining us now live. He's at the Academy of Holy Names with this story. And this woman was upset and she just kind of mouthed off. What's going on there, Corey? Well, hey, Keith, good evening to you. We're told that she had just been fired here and on her way out of the building. That's when she threatened to shoot up the place. Locked up with a smile on her face. But the crime Anaya Smalls is accused of is nothing to laugh about. But it as a parent, scared the heck out of me. Hillsborough Commissioner Victor Christ, one of many parents, rattled after police tell us Smalls threatened to shoot up the Academy of Holy Names. I dropped my five, almost six-year-old daughter off at school, and there were armed guards there. The Academy of Holy Names, of all places. We're told Smalls was fired at the Catholic school Monday while working for the cleaning crew. Witnesses and students heard her shout, quote, I'm coming back and I'm going to shoot this place and all you people up. I think that it's just people letting off steam and for some reason those are the words that come out of their mouth that they're going to shoot up the school. The threat, serious or not, forced the school into a modified lockdown Tuesday as a precaution while police searched for Smalls. Lately there have been a lot of people that just said the wrong thing at the wrong time, um, but we're holding them accountable for that. Bottom line, don't threaten a school. It's against the law. We do not want to be the agency that misses a, uh, an obvious sign like that. So we're going to take them all very seriously. School officials are taking it seriously as well. They have beefed up security here on campus with more guards during school hours, and they also sent a letter home to parents. Keith? Well, times are different now, I suppose. Corey Davis, live in Tampa. Thank you.